Sublime Focus. Here we go. This one's also got a kind of a wacky layout. Um, for me, at least. This is five by five by one. Puts my fingers right by the CG. Pretty tall pin. Um, yeah, standing on 25, let's see. Oh, what a good shot. Don't focus on me, focus on the ball. Ha ha ha, see what I did there? All right, a few more left. Let's see. Oh, that was a little better shot, yeah. Seven pin, fall down. Okay, so let's talk bag, tournament bags. Um, this one is pretty close to a phase two just after the first few shots I've seen. Maybe a touch earlier. Again, I have kind of a different layout for me on this one. Every time, follows through, gets through the pins. Uh, for me personally, in college, I would probably have this one as a ball two with a touch of surface. But man, this one is going to be good. Let's see if we can repeat here. Ooh. Man, oh man. Let's scoot a bit left, get out of my comfort zone with this ball. I haven't really moved left with this at all. Let's see. I got about 17. Yeah, still does the same thing. Again, let's take after Austin here and just keep moving left. If this is the first video you see, you're seeing of this ball, uh, go give our other videos a check out. Go watch Austin throw these. Okay, even more left. Uh, this is, I think it's 804 cover stock, brand new cover stock on the 900 global side. Same sublime core. Oh, get up. Man, I haven't missed yet. More shot with the sublime focus again. Focus on the ball, not me. Oh, first bad shot of the ball. Oh, fall over, baby. All right, first comparison ball. Has to be the OG Sublime. This one's 802 hybrid cover stock, so a bit cleaner. Oh yeah. Right, so you saw that one kind of stayed on the line a lot longer. Uh, Sublime Focus kind of starts to read the mid lanes pretty early. Move a touch left. Much more down lane motion with that one. Okay, let's keep moving left with this one. Uh, the Sublime Focus, again, would be a two ball. This one would probably be a three ball, maybe a four, some polish. It's just pretty clean. 17, at the arrows. Send it, baby. All right, last comparison ball for the Sublime Focus. For some, undisputed goat of phase two for some it's a ball one for some it's a ball two in a tournament bag and for some it's a ball three so no matter where you put it it's a good one you can never go wrong with a phase two okay so if you saw on that one this one's a bit more round than the sublime focus uh, they're both pretty fresh out of the box Touch left. That was a bit forward. It does throw them around. Doesn't matter. All right. Let's move more left, shall we? Uh, this layout on this face two, I believe, is a four and a three, three and a quarter inch pin. Uh, it's pretty standard for me. Yeah, it's too far left. All right. So I owe. Four three quarter inch, four and three quarters inch of a pin. Uh, like I said, it's pretty standard. But hey, five by five by one on the Sublime Focus might be the uh, new go to. Oh, that was a bad shot. Daddy ball. Woo! Let's pretend to be a good bowler again. Man, these two videos have been uh, pretty crazy. I don't think I've ever thrown this many strikes in my life. 
Ooh, that was around it, forward and around it. Two not so great shots back to back, but hey. Okay, let's move back to the right so we don't flat 10. And more importantly, let's just throw a better shot. That was a little better. Can't throw a strike without a thumb. Okay, back to the sublime focus. So we're standing on about 30 with the phase two, looking about 17, pretty wide angle. Let's see. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness.